need a mod in Discord for real, for real. Those mods, my mods are whack. <laughs> now I told them to ease up on my female. Um, we we trying to open up the demographics. Another thing about my Discord too, y'all got to stop. Excuse the term. Like here's the term. You guys ever heard of the term scaring the hoes? Like not calling not calling you a hoe in general, but I'm saying like there's a term called it's like a ghetto term called scaring the hoes. All right, y'all gotta relax. Like, ever since I was a kid, niggas been thirsty in any type of a chat. Niggas gravitate towards any woman. Lola F. Bunny, thank you for the two gifted. I appreciate it. Lola motherfucking Bunny, excuse me. Um, What's that? Riku. Riku Namoko. Thank you for the 100 bits. Hope I said that right. Spy, thank you for the sub. Bro, let me tell you, when I was a kid in AOL... Chats, niggas were thirsty. Xbox 360 days, people heard a girl on a mic, niggas were thirsty. Discord, y'all see a girl in Discord or somebody that allures to being a woman in Discord chat, niggas are thirsty. Y'all start, start going after crazy, all that type of shit. We want... A female demographic that feels safe. Y'all got to stop. I don't want any of my female audience to feel like it's like it's some sexist shit. Y'all y'all timed out a female in my discord. That was a no, no. Run that shit by me next time. We need that female audience. All right. Don't be trying to over sex sexify when there's a female in the discord. Nothing. Just relax. Like y'all are not fucking in the first place. Just relax and be cool. Like, niggas really think they're going to wife up a random chick in Discord. Hold on, let me go. Uh, I got to get this Red Bull in the water. So what I'm saying. Like, Discord is just the new AOL. It's the new fucking, um, it's the new Xbox 360 chat. That's what that shit is. We want a female demographic that feels safe. Y'all got to stop. I don't want any of my female audience to feel like it's like it's some sexist shit. This chick, I wanted to stop and ask as you bend her over. It looks like a, a raw chicken. You ever bent a chick over before and it's like their ass is like instead of round, it's like a weird shape. This is what you call a grade A throwaway. Skinny, frail, petite ass chick with no good genetics. Y'all paying for this OF? Fucking crazy. There's no, she didn't even offer anything good genetically. At least if she was like 5'10 and had a body like that, you'd be like, all right, I could fuck her and maybe bring a football player or an NBA seed, but bro, she's not she's not even breedable. Bruh. I don't know how to top correctly. Some chicks will be single because they just simply can't don't. Like, why put it like this, guys? Did you wife a woman that just was acid head? Ask yourself that question. Would you wife a woman that sucks dick horribly? Every time you get top, it just feel like you dipped it in warm water. You don't like head? Man, that's crazy. I see a lot of niggas in here that head isn't a requirement. Damn, what type of niggas are you? The fuck? A head is a must. If I'm not getting blow pop top. You're not even qualified. The fuck? Bro, I wouldn't trust fucking a damn chick over there. Like, all these chicks just look like they're ready to finesse you and pass you clap or syphil. Bro, I'm... No one looks safe to fuck here. Maybe they just want to party? Please. Chicks don't walk around looking like they're ready to catch dates. If they're ready to party. All this pussy is for sale. That's why the cops out there. Come on now. Women of power. A lot of women of power. They like fucking with lesser men. Because they can control you. You're nothing but a puppet. You're a sperm bank. Here let me pull up the infamous pick. 
This is what you are when your woman makes more money than you on a grand scale. If you guys aren't both crazy millionaires, right? Here's you. This is all you are right here. I'm going to pull up the infamous pic. And she could just go grab another one and fuck. You just a nigga in, in cryo sleep and stasis. Got our breakfast in bed ready. You don't even like I said, a, a man that doesn't make make more paper, <clears throat> a man that doesn't make more paper than his woman. You don't even deserve to fuck. You don't deserve to fuck any position. Your wife should only ride your dick. You don't deserve to backshot her. You don't deserve missionary nothing. You don't deserve top. It should be if she want to give you top, it'd just be like a couple of sucks just to get you hard enough for sex so she could ride you. What the fuck do you deserve dominating positions for if you're not even making dominant money? I don't know. That's just my motherfucking ideas. I'm just one guy. You don't got to listen to me. I'm not, I don't care if you do or not anyway. These are my ideologies. Don't get lost in the sauce. All right, what the fuck is we doing? Oh, yeah, let me check my Twitter bookmarks. The Chow Buffet. They're at 11.40 for the $50 all-you-can-eat steak buffet. They have so much food and everything tastes so good. You can just tell by the way she looks. She got a foul box. Tastes this nasty, dirty, stringy-ass hair. Just, ugh. Any chick that eats a lot of food, too, is just disgusting. Because you know she'll be farting a lot, shitting a lot. So just the odor coming from her in general is disgusting. It's so good. The banana pudding tasted so good on top of my steak. All the workers were so nice. On top of her steak? Nice and everything was going good. But after four hours, one of the employees recognized me and showed my videos to the manager. Then this happened. Hey, some brunches, lobster and shrimp special for you. Thank you. No problem. Enjoy. Take all the time you need. I was so shocked. I've been here over four and a half hours, and instead of trying to kick me out, they gave me free seafood platter, free lemonade, free Coke. Everyone's so nice, and I'm so happy. The food is so amazing. I'm so thankful. They told me I could stay as long as I want, and they close in 40 minutes, so I asked for my check. Your meal's been comped. What? Everything is on. Your meal's been comped? Ugh, look at this chick. She was just sitting there eating for hours. I don't know, it's something about a chick that just eats a lot of food that just disgusts me. I don't know if there's anybody else like that, but yeah, it's just something about a woman that just gorgeous food. It just, ugh. Like, I don't even need to eat that much. Why are you eating that much food? Especially when I know you're shitting. You know, she was just farting in the car on her way back. Because you're going to fart. Because your fucking body is trying to figure out the acids. They're trying to break down all these proteins. It needs to release gases. Everything like that. So this chick's car probably stinks. You guys ever hopped in a chick's car and it just has like a combustion of like perfumes and like potential old fart dust? Just hop in the car like, I know this bitch been farting in here on the low. We want a female demographic that feels safe. Y'all got to stop. I don't want any of my female audience to feel like it's like it's some sexist shit. Sex? I feel like when there was fornication between these two, like he'd be fucking like, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, and she just sitting there like, mm, are you done? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, uh, and she's just like, mm, um, all right, all right, I, I came. He's like, ah, uh, 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 uh. I guarantee you that's how the sex went. 